This is David and Angie, and we live in a 12 by 16 tiny dry cabin in Alaska. We chose to go simple, so when we want to, we can simply go. We are the Rutherfords, and these are our roamings. morning beautiful people so here in Alaska it is almost spring it's actually spring on the calendar but it's not quite spring here we're getting up into the 30s during the day we're seeing some snow melt and we're seeing lots of beautiful sunshine so I think Maddie and I are gonna get out and get in a little bit of exercise and some fresh air and we're gonna go for a walk in our local park and just enjoy being outside. Come on. Load up.
ice is melting. Look, there's the ground. Spring is coming. Happy Resurrection Sunday, everyone. We woke up to pouring down rain. Slushy, rainy, snowy puddles. Daddy, like snow. Get that doggy. Get that doggy. Oh boy, look at all those. This, this is an Alaska egg. Can't see these colorful eggs in the snow? Can I take the candy out and put the egg back? So 
Uh, on the calendar, it's spring, but here in Alaska, it's not really looking like spring. It's snowing right now, and we still have like a ton of snow. But the calendar says it's spring. And we did our daylight savings time. So daylight savings in Alaska makes a huge difference because we're coming out of a long, dark, cold winter. And when we get daylight at eight o'clock in the morning, and then overnight, we get uh, daylight at seven in the morning and we're getting sunshine and um, people are wanting to get out and we're just restless and we're just waiting, waiting, waiting for the, to stop snowing and for the snow that we have to melt. And then we have to go through breakup season, which we'll explain when that gets here because that is a whole nother season in itself in Alaska. So that'll be in a video, hopefully coming soon when it happens here. And that is breakup season. So let me know if you guys have breakup season. But in the meantime, we all have spring fever. Do you know what spring fever is? Spring fever is when spring is coming or supposed to be coming because it says it's coming on the calendar or it's already passed. It's supposed to be spring and maybe where you're at, it is spring. But here, it's not quite spring. Last night we had eight degrees and today it is snowing and it's uh, 24 degrees right now. And so yeah, spring's not here yet, but we're all like restless with the daylight savings. We got more daylight, uh, the, the sun does shine and things melt and then we go back to cold at night and it freezes and so we're just restless and we want to get out and do things so it's called spring fever we're just not knowing what to do waiting just we're just waiting and so um a lot of times people will spend this time uh, spring cleaning and getting ready for summer because in alaska you do not stay inside in the summer you get outside and you spend as much time as you can outdoors enjoying the sunshine and soaking up all that vitamin D because you're going to lose it for about six to eight months. And so um, I am going to get busy and start doing some spring cleaning in the cabin. <music> go to the store today and I'm going to get another one of these organizational cubes because that one's actually broken and I need to clean all this area up and uh, declutter and organize this because this is I can't do this this is too much too much chaos for me so yep and we're gonna go to the store we're gonna get um, I need to get an, a six cube shelf cabinet thingy and some cube boxes. Um, I think I need a laundry basket because I got rid of my laundry basket and was using a laundry bag. Yeah, we don't put our clothes in the bag. This is what happens to it. So um, I think we need a basket again. And then, so I went to Target and I found this wire basket with a flat side on it. Uh, for laundry and then it has this liner here that you just put over to catch all the laundry so since I take my laundry um, next door to wash it 
I can always take this off and just take the bag and leave the basket here. This takes care of the laundry being on the floor problem. So, got this cube shelf. And I think I can put it together myself. Let's see if we can do that. Yeah, she is. You ready to go? Uh, yeah, Why? Uh-uh. I was supposed to come pick you up. Yeah. Can't remember that part. I never said Good grief. That. I never said that part, but I thought it was just obvious. Nothing's obvious. But I never heard from you, so I'm like, I figured. I did it not right then. It's okay. You can let it in. But just put the wrong pegs in. No, because I've already turned it around once, but that's not long enough to do the squat. I turned it around once already. Well, you're supposed to be long and short. I can't see nothing. I can't see nothing. Where's your long ones? That ain't it. They're supposed to be on that side, apparently. You scraped the other. You just put one together before. I know, but I didn't think. I thought we were going to fold it together more. Oh, my peg. This is B. This is A. Is this the then that this what? B. That one. Yeah, they fit in there. Good thing they make holes. The, these holes are for the screws. Oh. <laughs> Oh, and you need three? It says no, two. two. Okay. Because that's a screw. And then the same. The long ones. The same for. That's it. It's only three cube. One, two, oh. Did we do something wrong? We just put it together in the wrong order. No, that would be me.
I ain't got a handle on her. So. loft area so we got we each have six cube um, shelving there that's all of our clothing and then just the bed and the laundry over there and it's nice and clean and tidy I still need to um, go through and declutter everything again but I have it organized so it'll be easier to just go through each thing and declutter this room I'm still working on um, I have lots of random things here and there that I need to go through and declutter. Um, that's, that's David's side and it basically just needs, um, straightened up and cleaned. I don't declutter his things. And then this was the eight cube that was up here on the other loft. And I moved down there for books and, um, crafting items. And then this is my this is what's left this is what's this is my mess of things that i need to go through sort and declutter some of these things are already sorted these are just laundry and things i'm getting rid of um so i've done some some organizing up here it'll take a few more days of organizing little bits at a time And then this is the downstairs, uh, rearranged again. Um, I didn't, I didn't like the way it was. It just didn't feel, it just didn't feel right. So I rearranged it again to where it feels, feels better. And we are going to be working on flooring um, and a permanent kitchen. We're gonna build in a permanent kitchen. Um, there's our Maddie, she's on the couch. And this I've kind of reorganized. It's still a little cluttery. This is our cell phone and charging station here. Look, we have cords everywhere, so I'm not sure what to do with that. This is our this is our only bathroom area because we don't have an indoor uh, sink, an indoor bathroom sink or an indoor toilet. So this is this is all we have is our 
toothbrushing station. And then this is our catch-all things we don't know what to do with cat. So I've done a little bit. It's clean, but it still needs, uh, I still need to go through the cabinets again and declutter. And I don't believe that we've ever talked about our island that we built. So we're going, maybe I'll do a video next week or sometime about um, decluttering the kitchen again and this island on wheels with our stools and how we use that. I'm not sure if I talked about that or not. Our table and our stools because we don't have a kitchen table. So do you guys experience spring fever? Do you have that where you're from? Where the sun is shining brightly outside and it's daylight and you feel like you want to get out and do stuff, but it's not quite warm enough and you're just sitting twiddling your thumbs waiting for the snow to melt. That's what we do here. We wait for the snow to melt. It's not spring yet. But anyway, let me know if you guys have spring, a real spring, whatever that may be, where you're from, if you get spring fever, or if you've ever heard of breakup season. Thank you for joining us here at Rutherford Roamings. If you enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up. And we ask that you would consider subscribing. We will see you all again next Sunday. Have a blessed week.